hello good morning all today in this video we are going to discuss regarding the rec name in Uru. so currently in the screen you are seeing Uru version 15 community edition where we are continuing our Odoo 15 development tutorials so in this tutorial series we have already created two models in the database one is hospital dot patient for recording the patient details and the second one is hospital dot appointment for entering or recording the appointment details so if you open the patient so here you can see I have opened the patient patient menu and if you open the patient records so simply we have opened the patient record and i'll go to the another tab and i will open the appointments so this is the appointments and if i open this you can see here in the breadcrumb so this is called as breadcrumb you can see appointments slash hospital dot appointment of one so here it is coming like this but if you check the patient model it is coming as patient slash apple so if you go to the second record it is coming as patient slash Odoo mates and if i create a new patient let it be pineapple and if i select its date of birth june and if i save you can see here it is coming as pineapple but if you create a record inside appointment let it be pineapple and booking date same day and if you click on save it is coming like hospital dot appointment slash three so what is this this is the model name hospital dot appointment is the model name comma three what is three three is the id of the record you can see in the url it's the id of the created record so if i go to the another record here you will see appointment of one which is this record id id equal to one and if you go to the next id two and id three so why it is coming you might be thinking why it is coming like this here and why it is coming here so because in hospital dot appointment model we don't have a name field so if i go to the pie charm and here we can see inside patient dot py file we have the model hospital dot patient here we have a name field a field with technical name as name but in appointment model we don't have a name field so once you have a name field in your model it will be coming over here you can see it's coming over here but we don't have a name field here that is you have to define a rec name for every model so by default a rec name of a model is name field so for the hospital dot patient we don't need to define rec name because by default it will be taking value from name field so either you can leave it as empty so it will take name field or you can just give it like this rec name equal to name so but in appointment model we don't have a name field thus it comes like model name comma one so what we have to do here we have to define a rec name for this field either we have to add a field with technical name name in this model or we have to define rec name equal to which field I have to show rec name equal to patient ID. So I'm saying the rec name for this model is patient ID. So I have set rec name equal to patient ID. So what will happen now? Just you restart the service. And if you go to the UI and let's upgrade the module and we will see the difference. So I'll click on upgrade so the module will be getting upgraded now if i come back to the appointments and if i click on apple you can see apple is coming over here second one Uru mates then pineapple so you can see because we have defined a rec name so if you need to get some other field maybe rough you can put it over here rough so if you restart we will see right now we have seen apple the patient name is coming over here and we have just changed it to the rough field so in order to change get its effect you have to upgrade your module so the module has been upgraded go to the appointments click on ok you can see one two three from a reference field fff is coming here 
FFF is coming here. So you have to define a rec name for the field, rec name for your model. If there is name field, suppose if you have name field, you don't need to define rec name because rec name will take by default from the name field. So once you don't have a name field, you have to define a rec name for your model. Else it will be showing like hospital dot one. So if you just I'll cop do one more thing. So let me copy. So what I'll do is that simply inside appoint hospital dot patient, I will add a many to one field of appointment, appointment ID, fields dot many to one. I will put hospital dot appointment as a co model. So simply I'll show you one thing appointments. So I will show you one more thing appointments. So simply I have added a many to one field to the hospital dot appointment and let me add this in the view of patient form just to show you one thing. So let me restart the service and let me upgrade OM hospital module. So we will upgrade the module from here. So you can see the module has been upgraded. Now if you go to the patient's form view, you have appointments. So if you click on here, you can see the value will be coming from the rec name, which we have given here. So if you change it to, suppose if you remove the rec name, so we have again removed the rec name of the model. And if you try to upgrade the module, let me upgrade the OM hospital module. So simply what we have done is we have removed the rec name. You can see in the mini to one field also it will be coming like hospital dot appointment of one. Similarly what we have seen over here. Similarly as we have seen over here in the mini to one field also it will be coming like this. So this is because we don't have a rec name for the corresponding model. So simply you have to add it here rec underscore rec. So this is a syntax underscore rec underscore name equal to which field value you have to show. So right now I am saying a rough or you can put patient ID. So let it be rough itself just upgrade or restart and upgrade then you will be getting the minute one field listed correctly so i hope you understood what we have done so far if you have any doubts feel free to ask directly under the video we'll be trying to reply you as soon as possible so that's it for the day if you have any suggestions feedbacks or anything to share with us connect us in the email odumates at gmail.com and feel free to follow us in the social media so that's it for the day have a nice day thank you